Garlic is one of the most powerful natural medicines on the planet. But did you know the way you eat it can make or break its health benefits? Let's know the best way to eat garlic, according to science. Garlic contains a compound called allicin, the superstar behind its antibacterial, anti-inflammatory, and heart-protective powers. But here's the catch. Allicin isn't just sitting there waiting in the clove. It's created only after you crush or chop the garlic. Why? Because it forms when two compounds, allion and allionase, combine. According to a study published in the Journal of Nutrition, 2001, allicin is unstable and starts degrading within minutes after being produced. So timing is everything. Here are the top mistakes people make with garlic. Cooking it immediately after chopping. This destroys alanase before it can create allicin. Swallowing cloves whole. You miss out on allicin production. Overheating garlic. Allicin breaks down at temperatures over 140 degrees to 184 degrees. What are the best way to eat garlic chop or crush the garlic? This activates the alienase enzyme. Wait for 10 to 15 minutes. This allows maximum allicin to form. Study from the Journal of Agricultural and Food Chemistry, 2001, found that waiting 10 minutes increases allicin yield significantly. Use raw or lightly cooked. Add it at the end of cooking or use in dressings, dips, or teas. Optional enhancer. Combine with healthy fats like olive oil or vitamin C rich foods. These help stabilize allicin and enhance absorption. How much garlic should you eat? Most studies recommend one to two cloves of raw garlic per day for health benefits. But beware. Too much raw garlic can irritate your stomach or cause bad breath. Moderation is key. So, chop, wait, and eat garlic smart. If you found this helpful, hit like, subscribe, and let me know in the comments how you like to eat your garlic. Thanks for watching, and stay healthy naturally.